Welcome to the AnyWord Workshop. I'm Jenna, a content marketing manager here at AnyWord. And today we're gonna to explore how to organize your content in workspaces. Hey AnyWorders, I'm on AnyWord and we're going to create a product workspace. The goal here is to help you create and organize your projects according to the products that you are promoting. All right, so I'm gonna hit product workspace right here and you'll notice I've already created workspaces for coffee machines and coffee mugs, but now I'm going to create a new product workspace. So I'm gonna hit add new and simply write in the name here of your new product workspace and then hit save. All right, awesome, we've created a product workspace for coffee pods, and now I'm gonna jump into one of my other workspaces just to demonstrate how it works. So I'm gonna go here, and I'm gonna go to coffee mugs. So the brief that you created for your first project in a particular product workspace is shared across all the projects. So now I can go ahead and create any project that I want in here, and it'll have the same information in the brief. So let's create new landing page copy for our coffee pods, and you'll see that all the information is already filmed in our brief, including the product description, the product attributes, and any customer personas that you've created. All right, and if you wanna see all of your projects in a particular workspace, just hit projects up here. And these are all of the projects I have created specifically for the product workspace of coffee mugs. If you wanna see all of your projects in a different product workspace, just select your product workspace up here and you'll see all of the projects that you've created for another product workspace. All right, now I'm gonna jump into our personas tab right here. And these personas that I've created are also within this specific product workspace. Keep in mind, you can create as many product workspaces as you want by just hitting add new right here. And you can also delete any of your product workspaces by just hitting delete here. Always be careful when deleting a product workspace because this will also delete all of the projects you created within this particular workspace. 